Hi everybody, this is Susan here. Welcome back to our cooking channel. For today, we're going to be making some delicious, hot, splattering, sizzling chicken. First, we will be nuking our ginger slices there. Then we will add in our Asian mushrooms, Chinese mushrooms here. These mushrooms we have uh, let them soak in some boiling water for them to grow nice, big and plump, as you can see here. We're going to be stir frying this for about 5 minutes to let the ginger flavors coat the mushrooms all over. Next, we're going to be adding in 1 teaspoon of sugar and then a nice teaspoon of salt, just sprinkled all over. We're going to fry this for another three to four minutes. Just let the mushrooms soak in the seasoning. And we're going to be adding in some more water here, about one cup, just to let the flavors soak into those mushrooms. And we're going to add in more flavors here, a good few dollops of oyster sauce. There we go. And we're going to let that cook for another five minutes, and then we're going to take it off the fire just now. We will marinate our chicken pieces here with a good sprinkle of white pepper, a good drizzle of uh, soy sauce, two teaspoons of salt, and one teaspoon of sugar. Never mind, make that two. We're going to add in a nice big teaspoon of oyster sauce here as well. There we go. And then some chicken stock, one teaspoon, and one and a half tablespoons of cornstarch to get everything nice and sticky and then some aromatic Chinese sesame oil a good drizzle and uh, some Chinese rice wine a good jazz of that also and then some extra ginger and a big teaspoon of garlic to end things off we're going to smooth it over with some oil two tablespoons and we give it a nice good mix. Leave this mixture for about five minutes just so that everything's coated and flavored. And now we're going to throw them into a wok here, which has been preheated and already nuked with some ginger. Next, we're gonna be adding in the seasonings again. One teaspoon of bean sauce, one teaspoon of poison sauce there. And then we're going to let that cook for a moment, about five minutes while we're preparing our other ingredients. We are going to loosely chop our green pepper here and also slice one whole onion. Give this a good stir now after it's been cooking for about five minutes. There we go. Just to make sure all sides are cooked. And then we're going to add in our mushrooms from before and the green peppers and some uh, onions here we're gonna leave some for later for the iron platter there we go here it is and we're gonna put that on the stove here to get hot we're gonna stir fry this some more just to mix everything nicely as you can see the mushrooms uh, have ab absorbed all that liquid from before so there's no more liquid anymore and uh, yeah, it's busy being coated and mixed together in this stir fry. And we're just tasting here. We're going to add in a few more sprinkles of salt and a good dash of soy sauce. It didn't, uh, it was a little bit bland there. And we're going to fry this for another five minutes or so. There we go. Mix everything up nicely. It's smelling so good and I can't wait to eat this. Adding in a little bit of hot water for a little bit of sauce. And our platter here is nice and hot. Be careful when you do this. There we go. And it's sizzling hot right now. Careful your fingers. We're going to be adding one teaspoon of margarine or butter. This will bring a nice aroma and extra flavor to our food. Make sure when you do this uh, that you're wearing protection uh, or it's going to splatter everywhere. There we go, let that melt a little bit. And we're going to be adding in our leftover onions. There we go, it's smelling heavenly. Now we add in our stir fry. It took us a little bit longer to bring the wok here to our main table here. But normally when you do this, it should be smoking and sizzling even more than now. Though it is sizzling right now also. 
And there you have it guys. I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a nice like. Also remember to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Thank you so much guys for watching. Please leave comments. Tell us what you liked, what you didn't. We really do appreciate all your comments. And yeah, there you go. We're nearly done. We also like to add a nice dash of white paper on it afterwards to give it a nice zing. And we're done. Thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, gotcha gotcha till next time. Susan signing out.